Let's just run it out and hope there aren't 10 things for me to get to. What was that? I keep having like red flashes. No! Jesus Christ. What's up guys, welcome to Siren Head. Uh, a not so original name for what I'm pretty sure is one of the very first attempts at making a real Siren Head game. Look, there was a lot of stuff out there before this, but as far as I could tell, they weren't really games. They would just be a couple minutes long, you'd be walking, you'd hear weird noises, you'd run into Siren Head, and then that's it. They didn't really have any gameplay. But I've heard good things about this, and after having played Retribution on the channel, and so many of you guys enjoying that, I figured this would be the next best thing to try. So, how was your day? Oh, mine? Going great. I, I'm just getting ready to run from a meat-covered megaphone for about an hour so that half a million people can laugh at me. School is over and my friends want me to go camping with them. Video game characters need to stop camping. Like, it never ends well for them. Just think about it. I don't really like camping, but you know, my friend said, Hey, Freddy, you never hang out with us. You're always at home playing... A Atari. Oh, so this is like the 70s. Well, I did just get my driver's license. May as well go and have some fun. Hey, it's the first day of summer. South Point Meadows, here I come. Or, and hear me out, what if we get a garbage disposal, we tack it to the top of a telephone pole, and then jump in while yelling into a ham radio? You don't need camping, you don't need friends, you don't need Siren Head, you could just cut out all the middlemen. So, is that a no to the whole garbage disposal idea? Welcome to South Point Meadows. It's dark out here, so use F to use your flashlight and E to interact with objects. Don't shine your flashlight too long. It could irritate people or some things. We definitely don't want to piss off some things. Also, use R to ping your next objective if you get lost. Got it. Now, can I please get back in my car and drive away? Why is that never an option? I want that to be an option. It might not be an option because my windows are made of cardboard. Okay. That's concerning. Is that one of Siren Head's abilities? Siren Head single? This looks like the world's creepiest forest speed dating. Uh, no, no, you're not my type, Siren Heads. I, I'm gonna update my Tinder profile right now to read guys 50 feet and under need not apply. Oh my god, it's so freaking dark out here. And this does literally nothing. E except for... Except for probably piss off footsteps. Okay, yet the car is the thing of the past now. What was the, the ping button? What was the ping button? I can't remember. Was it R? I should have been reading rather than making jokes. Oh, it was R. Yes, okay, good. <gasps> that's not Siren Head, right? Pretty sure that's just a cell phone tower. Every time I see one of those, I'm still incredibly thankful that there is no cell phone tower head. <laughs> that would definitely fit my Tinder profile. Um, should I be running? Nobody can answer my questions, I'm gonna run. Sometimes they only give you so much run, this is worth it. I don't care if it's dark, you guys can't see anything. Tough tits, this isn't visual entertainment, this is terror. Uh... Ooh, it's just a hill. Everything's fine. We're going over here. Ooh, light. It, it's light. We've got, we've got, oh, hey, camping friends. Breaking news, a friend group from Oregon High School has gone missing in South Point Meadows. Officials say they are uh, for them and may take some There time. is no radio at this campsite. It's coming from over there. I don't like that. Don't like that. Uh, hello? I would like inside now. Is that blood? Oh. Oh, that's not good. Press the C key to crouch. Use this ability to get into tight areas or if you get stuck around short trees. Crouching can set you free. I would assume that S makes you go backwards. Sometimes S makes you crouch. Maybe it's just shit your pants in terror. Not really sure. No, it's backwards. Okay, and then this is crouch. That's a, that's a quick crouch. I probably should go to the ranger's watchtower. Okay. We really not going to worry about all this? I mean, maybe your friends are still in there. They don't exactly have tampons out in the woods. Bad joke, Siren Head. I'm gonna assume that's a bad joke. Okay, where are we going? This way. This is the way. 
I should probably be using my flashlight. Oh, but I really don't want to. If everything looks, I keep the not, whoa. No, 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 I want, I want this, I want this again, we're going back. Everything looks like it could be Siren Head because for some reason my eyes are TVs. I can't explain it. Everything is scan lined and it's making it really, really difficult to figure out whether or not I'm about to get thrown into a tree inside out, upside down. Hopefully not. I'm gonna run. Everything, everything is running now. Flashlight does literally nothing. I can't get over how little it does. Should I be following some kind of road? Is there a road? These footsteps? I have a limited amount of sprint. Okay, that's good to know. Uh, I'm still gonna go with my tampon theory. Still gonna go with my tampon theory. That sounded like a woman screaming. <laughs> Listen, man, cramps suck. I am totally in your corner. I will head to the drugstore right now. Right now, I am well on my way. <laughs> Where is this ranger station? Is it running away from me? <laughs> I don't like this. I'm just gonna throw it out there. Not a big fan of running through the woods in the dark. Could definitely use, oh crap, oh crap. You can easily get stuck on this stuff. Uh, There's no telling that siren head. That could have been a pterodactyl. It was just kind of like, whoa, whoa, whoa. See, I could do that too. Can I, I can't climb up though. I can't, oh my God, this was a mistake. Footsteps? Don't like, oh, maybe, maybe it's, maybe it's not footsteps. Oh, that's a tree. I thought those were legs. Jesus Christ, for something, for some reason things flashed red. I'm sweating and mumbling and I don't know what I'm saying. I just want to get up this goddamn hill. Why, why can I not go up it? Oh, no, I'm so close. Come on, come on. Yes, that looks good. That looks, that, that's bad. Okay, you're going to give me a tip now? Press the right mouse button to see further away. I don't think I need to see further away right now. I'm pretty sure I can sense the warmth of his ball sack on my chin. <laughs> this is used to make sure you aren't walking into a trap. Might be a little late for that, wouldn't you say? <laughs> yeah, it definitely feels like a trap. So does this anger you? I thought that was supposed to anger him. It made him vamoose. Oh, oh, okay, okay. No, 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 no. I can't run away. I can't get to the friggin' station. He's blocking me. Is this supposed to happen? Oh, okay, blinking. Blinking seems bad. He's behind me now. If he's behind me, that's, oh. He's behind me because he's gonna pick me up and drop me. Okay, I'm seeing some problems with this game. How about this time we follow the road? The road has to lead to the ranger station, right? It might be like the scenic route because it's over there, but at the same time, it definitely feels safer. You're playing ice cream truck music, you sadistic. <laughs> I don't like that at all. I also wasn't expecting him to give me that newborn redneck treatment. You know, they pick you up. Drop you on your soft, squishy skull. Don't appreciate that in the slightest. Is this still... Road? I think? Maybe? At least this is an incline that I can get up. Okay. So we're definitely going to encounter him soon. But we should have a clear shot to the tower. Maybe we won't encounter him at all. Weird. I don't know what I did to piss him off the first time around, but we made it. Maybe you just stick on the road. He just doesn't want you trampling the grass. He's a bit of a stickler for lawn maintenance. I don't really know. Either way, I'm going to hide up here and cry. He can't get me up here, right? I'm pretty sure, like, indoors and elevation and stuff like that is... his weakness. Uh... What did I just... Did he just kick the tower? Don't prove me wrong. Then again, if this place was safe, I would imagine we would find people here. <gasps> we did find a gun, however. I can hunt Siren Head? That doesn't seem like a good idea. It'd be like an action figure firing one of those spring-loaded nerf darts at your shins. 
To equip the rifle, press the 2 key on the keyboard. Press it again to put it away. You need to load each shot to use this. That can be done by pressing R to reload your next shot. So reload every time, and it's not going to reload automatically. One shot, one R. <laughs> Keep in mind that you can only hold one item at a time. Okay, I got that much. Still not sure what that's going to do against him. <laughs> this thing is for hunting elk, not giant monsters. How about this? Looks like the radio tower is down. There should be a cellular or under... Can we speak a little slower, please? Cellular or underground MacGuffin? Got it. I guess we're just gonna go over that way. Where's my gun? Uh, there we go. That's the good stuff. Screw the light. We're just gonna make a run down that way. It's literally where the sound is coming from. Why don't I just hang out up here and, uh, that's not how a scope works. Am I... Am I doing this? I think I'm I'm putting the scope up to the eye that I'm closing, right? Is is that what's happening right now? <laughs> Listen, Batman says we don't have to be afraid of people like you. He's right behind me, isn't he? Huh. No? Good, because you would have got 180 no scoped. <gasps> Where did he go? I guess if he can't get to you, he just screws off, and I am safe up here. Why would I not just live out the rest of my life here? I I could just you know, do this for ages. <laughs> do we follow the road, or do we just cut through the woods? Uh, I don't know. I mean, we didn't piss him off by taking the road the first time around, so we will follow the road again. Yeah, let, let's follow the road again, even though the road is just going to take me back to where we were. Right? Oh, stop with the ice cream truck music. <laughs> it's not okay. <laughs> oh, he's right over there. He's literally between me and the objective every single time. I can't handle this. There is a possibility that the trees will stop him from getting to me. Is that reason enough? Oh, where are you? Wait, oh, there you are. Get away. That worked! That actually worked! That that legitimately worked! That made him piss off! I saw blood! <laughs> Who would have guessed that the giant meaty megaphone would have meaty blood inside of him? Awesome! I only have nine bullets. Not awesome. Not even kind of awesome. <laughs> Let's just run it out and hope there aren't ten things for me to get to. What was that? I keep having like red flashes! No! Jesus Christ! No! There was no sound! He just appeared out of nowhere! I would have gladly shot him in the taint again, and it's gonna put me back at the very beginning again, so help me God! I didn't think Siren Head was overly intelligent, but he is straight up screwing with me on purpose. He's playing all of the radio chatter that discusses my missing friends. Just then, he talked about one of my friends whose body was found, and it looks like it was torn apart and a measurable force and blah blah blah, and like, now I'm staring right at him, and yes, I, I got it, I got it figured out, suck it. How do you like that? Yeah, go take a run. I'm right behind you. We're reloading and we're heading this this direction. I'm going through the woods. Screw it. I'm going right after him. Yeah, you, you want some? Bring it. If, if you're just going to randomly appear behind me anyway, what do I care? Where am I going? This way, this way. This is the way. Yeah, the road isn't worth it. I, I mean, I want to piss him off less, but at the same time, I, I, I didn't hear him that time. Maybe I missed it. There's a possibility that I missed it, but he's pretty friggin' loud. I was expecting, like, the ground to shake. And for the siren noises and, and stuff like that, but I got absolutely nothing. Maybe he just appeared I got really unlucky. Should I be taking out my flashlight? I really don't want to. Oh, what is this? That's a dead friend. Sarah, is that you? We heard Sarah a minute ago. Okay, uh, flashlight? Flashlight. He wouldn't be down here. Uh, Sarah? Sarah, oh, I don't, I don't have that Tampax yet. I'm sorry. <laughs> Bad jokes, I'm really sorry. What is this? Is this my new home? This is my new home. Yep, oh, bullets. 19 bullets. Okay, so we can really just spray and pray now. 
<laughs> That's what I like to hear. Uh, now I just need to get back to the tower and call for help. Oh my god, I have to go all the way back there. Officials have said after a month of searching, what? the kids can't be found. It is ruled out that one of the friends, Freddy Anderson, lured them out to the forest because he felt like they were holding him back in high school. That's right, Freddy. We all know what you did. Oh. He's speaking directly to me. Oh, that is weird. So it might not actually be radio chatter. There's no way somebody on the radio will be like, that's right, Freddy. We know that you led them out here. That you led them to the thing that killed them. So Sirenic can speak in this. Oh, I really don't like that. I got chills. I don't think the flashlight's ever going to help me. We got to go fully armed. Fully armed. Armed to the tits. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Should I be running? I'm gonna run. Should I run? Should I follow the road? I think I need to follow the road this time. Because again, if I come up to that hill, coming down over the hill is very different to coming up on the hill. So I'm gonna follow the road this time and just hope. Like, if anything, the road is better because it's brighter. It's, it's brighter. And I could do that. Yeah. Yeah. I could do that. I could see him coming and just flick shot. We got, the, we got the flick shots. This is where he's absolutely gonna attack me. I just have to hope that he doesn't appear on top of me again. Give me like three seconds, okay? Three Mississippis, three steamboats. That's all I ask. One Mississippi, two Mississippi, three Mississippi. Then you can wear me like a sock. But until then, you gotta count them. Please. I'm mumbling to myself again. I kinda just wanna stand like out in the open where there's a lot of light and let him come to me and try to like reset the timer on him or something like that. Like if I shoot him, would he then be like, oh, I'm, I'm gonna leave you alone for another minute and 26 seconds. Well, never mind, I made it. It's the bridge. I actually made it. Jesus, did that creature do this? How the hell am I supposed to get across now? I think I remember seeing a factory over there. A factory over where? Over there? So, no, he did hear. He's smart. He's smarter than me. <gasps> okay, well, down into the, down, down, down into, okay, we're gonna crouch. Yeah, there we go. I remember, I remember. See, see, and if I hit S, then I, maybe I can poop a little bit. Let's, come on, it's gonna be over this way. Factory, what, what, what would a factory do? How would a factory help? Unless it's a bullet factory. I don't think I really need it right now. Just, what, what do you mean you think you saw a factory? I never saw a factory. I'm you. I don't see diddly squat. All I hear is a pterodactyl. I think he's over that way. Cut in here. Oh, factory. Factory. Yes. 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 Almost over. The officer said it's this way. Wait, what officer? Said, said what? There are a bunch of buildings here, but I'm really confused. I was supposed to go to a bridge. They're not buildings, they're walls. They're useless as tits on a bull. Oh my God, I'm sweating bullets right now and not the kind of bullets that I'm putting into Siren Head. Where is he? I think this is the stuff that's hurting me. I think when I step on that, that's the red flashy. I figured that out as I was panicking. Over this way? Am I just running around in circles? It really feels like I'm running around in circles. It definitely feels like this is just over path, the same path, every path, the same stupid road. Where is he? I, I, I haven't seen him in like five minutes. Almost free. Just gotta get following this path. What path? What path? What path? Tell me. Tell me. Tell me a path. Oh my god. Bad. That's bad. Bad, bad. That was a footstep. This path. Is this the path you want? Okay. Good. Why are my bullets zero? What? What happened to my bullets? Did I sweat them all away? What happened to my bullets? This is bullshit. Okay, we're just gonna run it out. We're, we're not even gonna run it out. Okay, we got the cops. That's good. Cops are good, right? I can't move and I have no bullets. That's bad. But cops are good. Can I please move? 
I'd really like to move right now. What am I seeing? What is that? <laughs> Was it anything? I think I just disappeared or exploded or something. What? You know what, I think that's gonna be it for this episode of Siren Head, guys. Would you believe that that's actually the ending of the game? It's the good ending, it's the bad ending, that's what's supposed to happen, except not really because it bugged out. Again, like 100% of Siren Head games that I've played, the ending cinematic has been bugged. He's supposed to be there. He's supposed to be between you and the cops. I guess I could see him just a little bit in the distance, but he didn't move. He's supposed to actually run at you on all fours like a spider monkey and then jump you and you're dead no matter what. <laughs> it's endlessly frustrating, but that's it. And if you guys want to see more, as always, be sure to leave a like in the video, leave some recommendations for other Siren Head games in the comments, and maybe I'll return again to run around in the pitch dark with my eyes as TVs. But thanks so much for watching this video, I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.